Today, I'm going to show you the difference between Miracast and Chromecast and how the cast button works on most devices that have one. Some don't. Alright, so my three devices today to show you is I have a Roku 3 which has Miracast built into it. The Chromecast is this one and it can do screen mirroring as well as send the um, video over from a YouTube app as well as play other things I believe. While and the Roku can pretty much do the same thing as the Chromecast but it doesn't use the Chromecast screen mirroring. The Roku uses Miracast screen mirroring. Miracast screen mirroring. And when I say Miracast, I don't mean mirror like M-I-R-R-O-R. -R -R. In the Wi-Fi standard, they specify Miracast as M-I-R-A Miracast. This is the Screen Beam Mini 2. It is a Miracast device. It follows the Wi-Fi standard. Some devices can use it. Some are blocked from this and will only use a Chromecast to screen mirror. But the Chromecast can let you offload the work of the YouTube app onto the device. All right, this is my AT&T. Galaxy S3 and it likes Miracast. Okay, we will turn screen mirroring on. This is screen mirroring to SBD. This is screen mirroring to a Miracast device. This is Android. Go to settings. Okay, stop giving me all this stuff. Show me the settings. Boy, this is Stone Age. Um, my device. More. Where's the about device? This is Android 4.3, and it is using Miracast only. There we go. Now we can see that this is Miracast on the Screen Bean Mini 2 from uh, Action Tech. This is my Motorola G5 and let's look at it. It has screen mirroring too. Let's find the screen mirror. There it is, a cast button. And when you cast, it only finds Chromecasts. And off we go, connecting to a Chromecast. Let's find the cast menu again. There you go. There you go, BT2V. That's my Chromecast, BTV2. For screen mirroring. Now, something to know is, besides screen mirroring where anything can be on the phone, let's turn casting off. With a Chromecast, from any of these phones, you can Open up YouTube and let's see here. What's this? Looks like something fun from Vin Snow. Oh, my favorite guys, Tony and Chelsea. I can now watch it on TV. And it will just send this video over a link to the video. It's not actually, not actually mirroring my screen. So that's the two ways to cast. You either do it from the casting your screen on your phone when possible. Where's 
that clear button. Hmm. Okay, there we go. I cleared that out. It also killed showing up on the Chromecast. So those are the two ways that you use the Chromecast for this. They also have a Chromecast Home app, which lets you run stuff on the Chromecast, which I'm not going to go into today. I'm just showing you how to cast your phone onto the TV screen, either with the Chromecast or the Screen Beam, which only does mirror casting to put your screen or your, your phone or your tablet onto the screen. I believe it also works with Windows 10. I don't believe the Chromecast works with Windows 10, but I believe the Chromecast works with Chromebooks using the Chromecast for screen mirroring. Okay, now I'm going to talk about my Yoga Tab 3 Plus, which can see all three devices because it can work with Miracast and it can work with Chromecast. And it shows the Roku 3, but it's not working, it seems, right now. On the Roku 3, in order to get screen mirroring to show up on the device, you have to enable it in the menu, the system menu. Screen mirroring, I'm going to enable it. And then, the Roku is now available. Okay, here we go, I got all three. The Roku, Will now cast from my device. I hope. Let's see if this does it properly. There we go. Now the Roku is a mirror cast device like the Screen Beam 2.